Um, I wish I knew this before and it took me some time to realize this and not only realize it but to be able to apply it. You have to always think where the light's coming from in order to understand the shapes, okay, and the shadow shapes. Okay, actually what's going on here is pretty similar to what we, what we saw before. We have this and I'm squinting in order to be able to think of these shapes and not of an eye actually. Same happens with the mouth, okay? So we are not drawing a, a standard mouth right there. Take a look at those shapes. It's anything but standard. Well, I actually could use this as an example for cross hatching, for uh, perspective, light and shadow, planes, a, a thousand things, but we're, we're talking about abstraction and that's what I'm going to do. I have to stick to that. If not, I'm going to spend three hours nonstop and uh, that's it you know have always a good coffee <laughs> on your side some water if you're going to spend four or eight hours drawing 